Former child star Evan Ellingson's cause of death has been determined. A spokesperson for the San Bernardino County Sheriff's Department's coroner confirms to E! News that the actor died of an accidental fentanyl overdose. His death has been ruled an accident. The update comes a little more than three weeks after the young star, who is known for his work on the film My Sister's Keeper and the hit series CSI Miami, was found dead at the age of 35. According to documents from the San Bernardino coroner's office viewed by E! News at the time, Evan died at his residence in Fontana, California. One day after his death, Evan's family released a statement to NBC News, writing, Our family is heartbroken by the sudden passing of our beloved son, brother, uncle, and friend Evan. Evan was one of the most caring individuals who loved Jesus with all his heart. He had a sweet, childlike spirit with a smile that could light up a room. He was always thinking of others and wanted to use his own struggles with addiction to help people find hope. His family also shared that the star had been three years sober but recently relapsed after being prescribed opioids following a dental procedure. The family noted he was passionate about pointing individuals to resources for help, adding he often shared his journey of recovery through speaking engagements. The actor is perhaps best known for his role in the 2009 film My Sister's Keeper, which is based on the best-selling novel of the same name. Evan starred as Cameron Diaz's eldest child alongside Abigail Brennan. He also starred on the sitcom Complete Savages and as David Caruso's son Horatio Cain in CSI Miami, where he appeared in 18 episodes over three years.